retweeting, sharing, forwarding a message, we all do it. But whether retweeting, forwarding or sharing any kind of message on social media amounts to endorsing that particular message or that particular viewpoint or not, well, there is no clear-cut case law in India in this regard, but we do have provisions in IT Act as well as Indian Penal Code which can be invoked in case of uh, any kind of a retweet or sharing of a message or forwarding of a message. Uh, for example, Section 67 of the IT Act provides punishment for circulating or sharing any kind of obscene material through electronic media. Apart from it, we have provisions in Indian Penal Code which can be invoked against a person if, uh, if he or she shares or forwards any kind of uh, derogatory or obscene material. The grounds for invoking such provisions of Indian Penal Code could be hurting religious sentiments or uh, promoting communal hatred, uh, obscenity or uh, probably a defamation. These could be the grounds that one can take up. Uh, so in absence of any clear provision, uh, or any kind of uh, judgments to back up, it is left to the courts to decide whether in a particular case of retweeting or sharing or forwarding of a message, whether it in itself amounts to an criminal offence or not.